Breaking news. Lombok earthquake hits today, second quake hits Bali and Lombok, tremors felt no Lombok and Bali have been struck by another powerful earthquake, just a day after a devastating quake killed at least 98 people. On Monday evening, the popular tourist island Lombok registered a magnitude 5.2 earthquake. Reuters witnesses said the tremor woke residents and tourists who fled from their hotels. People are still deeply shaken by the magnitude 6.9 quake which struck on Sunday, killing at least 98 and injuring hundreds more. This comes just a week after Lombok was hit by a magnitude 6.4 quake on Sunday, July 29, killing 17 people. Rescuers are continuing a desperate search for survivors, using diggers and machinery to clear debris. The National Disaster Mitigation Agency, BNPB, said it expected the death toll to rise once the rubble of more than 13,000 destroyed houses was cleared. Power and communications were severed in some areas, with landslides and a collapsed bridge blocking access to areas around the epicenter in the north. More than 2,000 people have been evacuated from the three Gili Islands off the northwest coast of Lombok amid fears the quakes could trigger a tsunami. BNPB spokesman Sutopo Perwonugroo said emergency units and hospitals were overflowing and some patients had to be treated in parking lots. Staff set up about a makeshift hospital in the shade of trees and tents after the main hospital in the town of Tanjung was severely damaged. The Indonesian Agency for Meteorology, Climatology and Geophysics, BMKG, said more than 120 aftershocks were recorded after Sunday evening's quake. The 6.9 quake was powerful enough to be felt on neighboring Bali, where two people died. No tourists have been reported amongst the dead at this stage. The Indonesian military said it would send a ship with medical aid, supplies and logistics support. Mr. Nugroho said, We have yet to ask for help from the international community. But if there's any friendly country who wants to offer help, please do. British-based charity Oxfam said it was providing clean drinking water and tarpaulin shelter sheets to 5,000 people and planned to intensify aid delivery. The United Nations has offered to support rescue and relief efforts if required. The Indonesian Red Cross said on Twitter it had helped a woman give birth at a makeshift clinic. One of the names she gave her baby boy is Jempa, which means earthquake. The quake prompted a mass exodus of travelers. Long lines formed at Lombok's main Mataram airport as visitors cut their holidays short. Earthquakes are not uncommon in Indonesia, it sits in the Pacific Ring of Fire, an area of seismic activity which stretches right around the Pacific land masses.